So Jeremy and I are working on the platform, like the bedding platform and the wood rack platform for the wigwam. You cut a bunch of these small saplings and we're working on some more. The edge of the swamp here is a great spot because they're all growing pretty straight. So we're aiming for ones that are two to three inches diameter. That way we can use the most and have the least amount of waste. And uh, whatever we don't use, we'll come back here. And uh, once the rack is done, we'll come back and bring it back, cut it up for firewood, store the shelter. All right, we're in the shelter, guys. Here's the bedding platform we're working on. We're just finishing <clears throat> lashing the last of these su forked support pieces on here. And uh, then we're going to start, we're going to lay some branches on the ground in here. That way we can put firewood, store firewood facing this way underneath it. And then we're going to have a bunch of pieces we're going to lash across the top for our bedding platform. So I've been working on this for what, probably three hours now or something like that, Jeremy? Yeah. And uh, with two people, it's a lot quicker. I'm used to doing this alone, so having the help is awesome. But uh, yeah, it's coming along. It looks super cool. And I think it's going to work really well. It seems like it'll be really sturdy once we get the cross pieces lashed on in a few spots. All right, everybody, so here's where we're at. We've got the basic bedding platform and we've got wood laid down on the ground there so we can stack firewood going this way underneath the whole bed. It's all going to be firewood storage and whatever else we decide to store there. And uh, it's all lashed together and we're ready to put the, uh, the cross pieces. We're going to put cross pieces all the way down lashed on there until we run out of twine that is. Um, but it's very sturdy up and down and once we get the, the cross pieces lashed on and get it actually lashed to the frame of the wigwam. It's going to get rid of any of this little wobble, sideways wobble that we have here. And I think it's going to be awesome. It's pretty level too for what it is. So I'm real happy with it. What do you think, Jeremy? It's pretty great. cool. Yeah, came out awesome. Yeah, I'm proud of us. Proud of us. Pets on the backs. What the heck? We're in the wigwam and it's been so warm out. I think the salamanders think it's springtime to migrate and have their mating congress. This is a yellow spotted salamander. It's in the mole salamander family. I've shot videos on my other YouTube channel about these on my Animal World Experience YouTube channel. Uh, that's so cool. This sucker, what would you say, is like eight inches long, nine inches At long? At least, yeah. He's big. Wow, and he's just hanging out in here. We're we've got a fire going now and we're working on well, Jeremy's preparing sausages to have for dinner and skewers, <laughs> but I'm working on the platform, the bedding platform here, lashing these on. And he just comes walking in, and he's just hanging, just chilling. What's up, little dude? But the platform's coming out. Awesome. Oh, I saw that. I saw you moving. I don't want to, like, be working on this and, like, not see where I'm going and smush him or crouch on him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So we're cooking our dinner, and our little salamander pal is creeping along closer and closer. And Jeremy just named him Henry because we were shooting my Henry AR-7 survival rifle before, so <laughs> he's now the camp mascot, and his name is Henry. <laughs> and I don't know if he's if he gets any closer, he might have a death wish. I don't know, you know, slimy little guys should not be near the fire. You're gonna shrivel up like a salamander mummy. Salamander sausage. Sound, uh oh, uh oh. All right, so we had our dinner. We're just kind of letting the fire burn out, and then we're gonna head out of here. But we did a lot of awesome work on the platform here. So this is gonna be this wood all the way across. Eventually, we have to get some more twine though. And uh, underneath, we lit, just laid those all down there so we can stack firewood going this way underneath it. And that's what that is. It's all gonna be storage. And uh, sitting up on that platform, it's nice and toasty. And it's comfy too. You don't feel like you're on a bunch of logs. So uh, thank you very much, Jeremy, for the help. This was pretty freaking awesome. You're welcome. Anytime, man. This is great. And then there's just our stuff. Some of our stuff. The entrance. So thanks for watching this, guys. Please check out our Patreon. It's uh, patreon.com slash animalmansurvivor if you want to get some really cool content. And all my YouTube videos go up a day early and without ads. So please check it out. I'd appreciate the support, guys. Helps me be able to come out here and do this.